I'm going to do her cheek now. Now, their cheeks need to be nice and flat. So we'll do this cheek nice and flat. Our pattern is going to come from the corner of the eye to this dark dot right here on her cheek. They all have a little bit of a different colored hair right there, regardless of their color. And that dark dot has to be exposed. It's usually right on the zygomatic arch, which is that curved bone right there that you can feel. You feel it. And so, and I like to use the real knife for that. And I like to just gently and slowly, because this hair is very similar to the shoulder coat. It's not a heavily coated area. So you can pull a bald patch in a hurry. And if you do, it's okay. It grows back. It's all right. So we're going to pull. And I'm actually pulling her uh, eyelashes as I'm doing this. You might not be even be able to see that, but the very end of my knife is getting her just across her eyelashes. That will really open her eye up. My line actually sort of starts at the corner of her eye and goes back. And now do you see that dark spot there? That's uh, where we want to expose that, which we have. You want to leave a good thumb width of hair in front of the ear to create the head. So I usually just stop about a thumb width ahead of that. And so I'll leave this bit of coat right here so that when we style her, her top knot blends into her ruff. 